Today we will talk about U-speed regimen of emergency contraceptive pills. As a gynecologist, you know that there are different regimens of emergency contraceptions which include copper IUCD, levonorgestrel containing emergency contraceptives and ulipristol containing emergency contraceptive pills. But sometimes these commonly used pills are unavailable or accessing emergency contraceptive carries a society stigma. So in such cases, the women are advised to take the monthly combined oral contraceptive pills by using a specific regime and that specific method of intake of COCP is called USP regimen. Let us talk about the history of USP regimen. This method was first developed by a Canadian professor of obstetric and gynecology, Albert Usby, as a method of reducing potential unwanted pregnancies, including pregnancy from rape. Dr. Albert Usby published this first study demonstrating the method's safety and efficacy in 1974. So, what is Usby regimen? We have the oral contraceptive pills like Chrysella. The Chrysella contain 100 microgram ethanyl estradiol and 1 milligram norgastrel, which can be used as emergency pills. It's because 1 milligram norgastrel is equivalent to 0.5 milligram levonorgestrel, which is present in emergency pills. But the method of intake is important. So, two doses are needed to be taken 12 hours apart. And those two doses contain 100 microgram ethanyl estradiol and 1 milligram norgastrin. So this method is called USP method. This is equivalent to the dose of commonly used levonorgestrel containing emergency pills like AMKIT. In other words, the USP method of emergency contraception involves 200 microgram of ethanyl estradiol and 2 milligram of norgastrin taken in two doses, the first within 72 hours of unprotected sexual intercourse and the second 12 hours after the first dose. What are the examples of combined oral contraceptive pills that can be used in the USP regimen? One example is tablet AVN. If the birth control pills like AVN is taken, that contains 0.02 mg ethanyl estradiol and 0.1 mg of levonorgestrel. In that case, we have to advise the patient to take 5 tablets per dose and then repeat that dose 12 hours apart. Because the 5 tablets will give 0.1 mg of ethanyl estradiol and 0.5 mg of levonorgestrel per dose. If the patient is having the tablet Chrysella, then that contains 0.03 mg ethanyl estradiol and 0.3 mg norgastrel. So in that case, we have to advise the patient to take 4 tablets per dose and this will give 0.12 mg of ethanyl estradiol and 0.6 mg of norgastrel per dose. How effective is USP regimen? This method is about 56 to 86 percent effective depending on the timeliness of the use of the sexual intercourse and it is most effective when used within 72 hours and less effective when used 72 to 120 hours after unprotected sexual intercourse. It is less effective and less commonly used than a larger dose of levonorgestrel alone or a dose of ulipristol acetate or insertion of copper intrauterine device. How USP regimen prevents ovulation? The estrogen and progesterone containing in OCP used by the regimen inhibit ovulation through gonadotrophin suppression primarily by progestin agents. And you can see the whole mechanism of action in this figure. You can see that when both FSH and LH are suppressed, the suppression of FSH results in lack of induction of any primordial follicles. As a result, no follicle develop and ovulation doesn't take place. So this is how the USP regimen prevents ovulation. Now let us talk about the complete mechanism of action of USP regimen. 
basically the use speed regimen is designed to be used within 72 hours of uh, unprotected sexual intercourse and it works by four different methods four different ways first of all it works by inhibiting ovulation secondly it causes thickening of cervical mucus thirdly it causes alteration in transport of sperms eggs or embryos and number five number four it causes direct inhibition of fertilization so by these four methods by these four ways it results in prevention of unwanted pregnancy so that was all about the use speed regimen if you want to study other methods of contraception in detail go to the link given in the i button in the top right corner of this video i would like to complete my video with this quote that be appreciative optimistic and positive about your life so thank you so much i wish you all the best allah hafiz